Hello fellow exiles and welcome back to the exiled lands. Um, this is going to be just a really quick video. I wanted to show you guys something. Um, many of you may already know this, but I've just figured out what was going on during this recent playthrough. Um, you've seen a couple of spectacular, beautiful deaths. Um, the problem I was having was getting in combat. And I couldn't get away from combat. I couldn't disengage. I couldn't run and pull my companion with me. Um, the result being both of us being killed. It occurred to me that something might be going on other than blaming my bird for putting seeds in my keyboard. And I figured it out and I wanted to share just in case this helps somebody. Problem for me is in the target lock system. And these little guys over here are going to help me demonstrate the aiming dot up there. That was the key that helped me figure out what was going wrong. Most of the time, it's just the aiming dot is just the single dot. I can run up to this little guy. I can run circles around this guy. I can run on by. Same with this little guy. If I activate target lock... I am zoned in on this guy and I can't run past him. I can't get away from him. Try as I might to turn. I cannot get away. I focused my attention over here and my target lock did switch to this little guy. But what's happening is I'm able to switch my target within the area, but I can't get away. And if you notice, the aiming dot now has, try to get it where you can see it, the aiming dot now has parentheses around it. That was the thing that finally made me realize something was different, and this is target lock. Can't run by him. Can't do anything but turn in a circle facing him unless I switch to another target in this area at which point I can run as far as that guy and then I'm going to dance in a circle around him target lock off I can run and I am free to flee and call my follower with me so target lock system you're going to go into your settings server settings, combat, and all the way down at the bottom there is enable target lock. Activates the target lock system making it possible to lock on enemies and neutrals. And enable auto facing on attack. This activates the auto targeting system when using the gamepad. So the target lock was the thing throwing me off. Well, the next thing I had to figure out was how was I going into target lock? I didn't even, it wasn't even something I knew I was doing. So I looked through the key bindings, toggle target lock, and it's Q next to W, which is, of course, the running key. I'm on PC, so I'm on a keyboard, and that's how you move. Q is next to W, right up in there in those whole four moving keys. Q is off to the side. I was hitting Q accidentally, engaging in auto lock, and couldn't get out, or didn't know how to get out. So what I'm probably going to do is turn off target lock, because I haven't been using it, which it was designed to achieve. So I am going to turn off my auto lock, or target lock. And that should help keep me where I can, when I know it's going badly, I can run and I can pull my thrall with me. So yeah, that's what I wanted to jump on and tell you about today. Like I said, it's nice and quick. Target lock. If you like it and use it, great. If you find out it's causing you problems, you know where to go to get rid of it. All right, I will see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care, have fun, and play nice.